Well, we're at Broadway Quarry, uh, <clears throat> which is uh, located on the northwestern edges of the uh, uh, Cotswold area of outstanding natural beauty. Uh, we're just uh, on the top of Fish Hill, uh, um, um, uh, above the village of Broadway itself, uh, on the edge of the escarpment, which looks over the, uh, the Vale of Isham. <clears throat> Uh, the quarry uh, has been here since the 1890s, we believe, um, <clears throat> uh, and has worked uh, local Cotswold stone for local buildings. In fact, some of the uh, buildings in Bro uh, Broadway itself were built with the stone from here. And uh, Smiths have bought the quarry since 1986, <clears throat> um, uh, where they, they've worked the stone for building stone and aggregates and the site's uh, now being restored uh, with an emphasis on, a focus on, uh, na on nature conservation and geology. Well, you've seen some of the wonderful work being done here at Broadway Quarry. Let's talk to John Bell now, who's the operations manager for the quarry's four smiths. You must be so proud of what you've achieved here. Yes, it's really good. Um, we're giving something back to an area that has been quarried out and that's probably the way forward for how we're, we're moving across many of our sites. It's something where we're creating diverse landscapes from what has been agricultural plain land in the past and we're moving that forwards. And what do you think about this quarry now? When you look around and you must have seen it when it was a quarry yeah. and now you look at it it really is an incredible site, isn't it? You, you've got some beautiful habitats being created. To be fair, some of which existed when the quarry was in operation. The birds, the peregrines were around then. Um, but yes, we've got so much more opportunity to, to get different species involved and open it up for, um, yeah, for more wildlife. We've travelled a few miles down the road from Worcestershire to Oxfordshire to see Smith's Duns Tew Quarry and this really impressive restoration project at the Horsehay West Nature Reserve. So the idea of the restoration was uh, primarily for conservation and biodiversity. Um, we've got a, a shrubland, which is a shelter for, for many animals, including birds. Uh, the idea was, in terms of geology, was to leave the face, which is behind us now, 230 metres of face, ultimately for uh, a colony of uh, sand martins that have been returning since about the 1950s, 60s. Um, so since the 1980s they've been recorded in their numbers up until obviously this year we had up to about 100 um, pairs. Um, that's the main objective really is, is to increase habitat and biodiversity. 